My name is Miguel Moss, my pronouns are he, they, and I am a queer aspiring author with Erlen syndrome. Here. Sometimes I wonder why we tell stories, why we write them down, because there's a lot of reasons you could do that. And throughout history, separated by time and space, oceans and mountains, people have taken the time to write their experiences and what they see around them, or what they don't see around them. <laughs> and I can't speak for everyone, but I can certainly speak for myself when I say that writing is a way to be understood. I think in all of the different experiences we have, writing tells the story of who we are, whether we're writing about ourselves or not. I personally don't write about myself very often. I set my stories in fantasy worlds with characters seemingly different from myself, but yet so similar to me and the people in my life. Unintentionally, they act as vessels to be understood to share my experiences being who I am with other people. I think there's kind of a beauty in being able to understand someone through something that they've created. But I really hope that my writing and my YouTube videos help make an impact and help people's understanding of the queer experience and the experience of disability and what it's like to be alive. I think we can all um, relate to just living life. Currently, I'm working on a young adult dystopian novel titled Project Mist that I hadn't planned on writing. I actually told myself I wasn't going to write it, but something in me really, really needed to do it. And that was back in December of last year when I told myself I wasn't going to write it. And by January, I knew I had to do it. It started out just being a story about a world where children can see the future and ended up becoming a story about the world that we live in. Like, it takes place in the future, but it ends up really reflecting how I think society tends to function and the way that people are afraid of the things that they don't understand, even though there's no reason to be afraid of them. I think sharing these stories can help with that, help people understand, or at least I hope that's what they do. I hope this video serves as a little bit of a channel trailer for um, what I want this channel to be in the future, and I hope that this video inspires you to write your story, because I think Everyone has a story that only they can tell. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope to see you here again next time, Created. Thanks, dude. I was getting really deep. <laughs> you come here, you say hi. Currently, I'm working on... <laughs> the crows are all going crazy. <laughs>